SCP-2743 Suttinger Nevermore Object Class Keter Special Containment Procedures Any attempts to view the area of space containing SCP-2743 via high-powered telescope are to be covertly sabotaged. Due to the size of SCP-2743 instances and its distance from Earth, academic and government-backed astronomy centers are the only institutions that require monitoring. Observational satellites have been placed in orbit around each instance, as well as three surface probes equipped with a thermonuclear device with a yield of approximately 30 megatons. In the event of a discovery, a cover story is to be disseminated among the astronomy community, attributing all findings to a practical joke. The original publisher of the report, or photographs, is to be discredited by any means necessary. At this point, the thermonuclear probes must be detonated to prevent a broken masquerade scenario. Because of the continual advancements in the fields of astronomy and space exploration, the discovery of SCP-2743 is considered an inevitability if it remains in its current orbit. As such, the ongoing development of physical containment methods for SCP-2743 instances is a Class IV priority. Description SCP-2743 designates four organic satellites within Saturn's Phoebe ring. The Phoebe ring is made primarily of debris from Phoebe and orbits Saturn at a distance of 180 to 250 radii. The ring itself has a thickness of 40 radii. These satellites, ranging from 2 km to 5 km in length, have been identified as the corpses of four Jotnar class, an anomalous species of extra-dimensional entities referred to by Norse mythology as Jotun or giants, humanoid entities documented as SCP-2743-1 through SCP-2743-4. All four instances were discovered wearing armor and clothing resembling 10th century depictions of Norse mythological warriors. Addendum 2743-A Report 2743-1 Discovery February 23, 2000 Rhea Orbital Satellite revealed SCP-2743-1 approximately 13 gigameters from Saturn's outer atmosphere. Subject Subject is a humanoid entity measuring 2.1 kilometers in length with the physical appearance of a human female between 8 to 10 years of age. Notes Subject appears to have expired due to blunt force trauma to the zygomatic and maxilla region which caused the entity's facial structure to collapse inward. A large portion of the subject's hair has been forcibly removed along with three fingers from its left hand. Report 2743-2, 2743-3 Discovery May 13, 2003 Rhea Orbital Satellite revealed SCP-2743-2 and SCP-2743-3 in close proximity. Subjects are approximately 15 gigameters from Saturn's outer atmosphere. Subject SCP-2743-2 is a humanoid entity measuring 2.9 kilometers in length resembling a human male approximately 13 through 14 years of age. SCP-2743-3 is a humanoid entity measuring 3.8 kilometers in length. Subject's body structure correlates to a human female of approximately 35 to 40 years of age. Notes SCP-2743-2 was found with its sternum shattered and its ribcage separated from the thoracic vertebrae outwards. SCP-2743-2's lungs had been removed and stretched over its ribcage. This resembles a technique referred to by Nordic cultures as the Blood Eagle. Based on collagen formations at the site where the ribs had punctured the lungs, SCP-2743-2 remained in its state for an extended period of time. Additionally, self-defense injuries were noted on its hand and forearms. SCP-2743-3 was found holding SCP-2743-2, its likely cause of death is decapitation. The location of SCP-2743-3's head is unknown. Report 2743-4 Discovery Due to its orbital location, SCP-2743-4 was discovered on September 28, 2006 by the Rhea Orbital Satellite, approximately 17 gigameters from Saturn's outer atmosphere. Subject SCP-2743-4 is a humanoid entity measuring 4.6 kilometers in length with the physical appearance of a human male between 35 to 45 years of age. Notes The surface of SCP-2743-4's body is covered in severe Lichtenberg figure. Lichtenberg figures are tree-like patterns that may appear on the skin of lightning strike victims. 
Scarring. The subject's ocular, nasal, and oral passages show signs of charring and necrosis. The likely cause of death is repeated exposure to high-voltage electrical currents. An object resembling a 10th century Norse sword, measuring 3 kilometers in length, was placed through SCP-2743-4's head on the longitudinal axis, exiting the torso via the groin. Evidence indicates this was done posthumously. A granite slab measuring 1.1 kilometers in length was discovered near SCP-2743-4. This slab, designated SCP-2743-4-A, has Norse runes etched into the surface. See SCP-2743-4-A translation. SCP-2743-4-A translation. Behold man, the treachery of Acer. The Acer was one of the two main tribes of deities worshipped by Norse religions. Line of Suttnagur, rest in cold cairn. Weep for poetry lost. Drink and remember oaths sworn. Our peace ended in blood. Ragnarok beckons. Thank you for listening to SCP-2743. If you enjoyed this SCP, please like and subscribe, and follow the link in the description to the SCP Wiki devoted up to support it and the SCP Wiki as a whole. Also, if you have any SCPs you'd like for me to do, please leave a comment below, and I'll see what I can do.